hi everyone welcome back to the channel today in this video i am going to address a common questions which is coming across a lot of videos that why my interface is looking different from what you have okay so this is specifically for the beginners who are looking into the beginner playlist and following the video step by step or in case you are already a subscriber who is looking into a different video which is older you might be having a different interface right why that is the reason and the answer to that question is the ui path version which you are using right so for example if you see on my screen i am into the 2024 ui path community version and in this version the modern design experience is the default experience now what does it mean ui path has two design experiences one is classic and one is the modern previously we only have the classic then ui path came with something which is modern previously modern was optional then the developer has option options to switch from classic to modern modern to classic and now with this latest updates modern design is the default experience so developers who are using the community edition or who are using the latest version of ui path studio you do not have option to go back to the classic design and you have fix that you need to use the modern design okay now a questions which come up is that i am a beginner i am following your playlist right and now your interface is looking different because when i made the video that time it was classic should i still watch that and the answer to that question is yes right because because for the community edition it is still modern as the default experience but when you go to a client a customer who might be at a older version you need to work on a older version then you need to know how does the classic design work and trust me both the modern and the classic are exactly the same there is a difference in the concepts right so you need to know both the design experiences you start with classic then you go to the modern the only thing would happen is that you won't be able to see the things working into your laptop into your computer because you are def default in the modern design but having a knowledge is mandatory of the classic design as well then only you will appreciate that why modern design is better right now coming to the playlist for this playlist if you see what i have done now is wherever there was a classic design which was involved you would see a word which is written classic see this one basic web desktop recording i have put the classic tag here that means that this video is now for the classic design this video is for the classic design this video is for the classic design okay so that way you just know that okay this is for the classic design i need to grab this concept make my notes and then for this same i need to watch the modern design videos so if you continue the same playlist just by watching this you have a knowledge of classic now you come down and you would see the modern design experiences video as well okay and since modern is the default experience i have created a full playlist on the modern design experiences right so if you come down then you would have all the modern design videos available into the same playlist right so in case you are following the playlist which is this one make sure that you watch the tag if it is classic you won't be able to do the practicals but you need to have a knowledge of classic because of the client or the customer you might work with right and recently i also know a lot of customers or the clients where i personally work they are still using the classic design right so you need to have knowledge of both and that's why you have a different interface okay any more questions any more doubts feel free to write me in the comments or you can also drop me an email as well right all the best for your learning journey and uh, thank you for watching okay so that is pretty much i wanted to cover in this video i hope now you guys have a clear understanding on what are modules and how do you use them in the python in the next video we are going to see how we can utilize some of the built-in modules which are available from python so with that wrapping this video here thank you for watching any more questions any more doubts feel free to write me in the comments or you can also drop me an email as well thank you for watching and see you in the next video of the python series